Okay, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to mathematically figure using the Doyle scale and see if it matches up to the Doyle folding rule. Okay, so the equation that you're going to use for this is D, which is the diameter of the, the tree in inches at the small end, subtract 4, and then you're going to square it, so that means multiply it by itself, multiplied by the length in feet, and then you're going to divide by 16, okay? So I picked a log that was 16 feet long and 14 inches in diameter, okay? So 14 minus 4 is 10, 10 squared is 100, times 16, over here we got 100 times 16 gives me 1600, Divided by 16 gives me 100 board feet. And then if you look on your rule, you come over to 14, you flip it over till you read 16 feet, and the number is 100 board feet. Okay? So this equation takes into consideration that they subtract 2 inches off each side of the diameter where the sapwood is. Okay, so that takes into consideration with the sapwood, whereas this chart does that already for you. So you can just measure whatever distance you are, and it's already calculated in there that it's subtracted off that sapwood. Okay, so it's subtracting off the sapwood and then multiply it by the length in feet, divided by 16, and it'll give you 100 board feet. So either you can use this folding rule or you can use this equation right here. The diameter of the tree in inches minus four squared times itself, times the length in feet, and then you're gonna divide that by 16 and you'll get the same answer that's on the Foley rule. So figure using the Doyle scale mathematically.